everyone welcome back to my channel and today I would like to show you guys um, some beach cosmetics haul and a few drugstore haul so um, I'm just so excited to use them that's why I really want to do the haul right away as soon as I got my package from beach cosmetics and uh, they're basically um, non makeup I think I only have one product the lip liner so um the first thing that i'm going to show you guys is this um this is the rose gold set for makeup brushes and it is really beautiful it, they are so soft i mean for the price that i paid for it it's really really soft and um it's beautiful and i just love the way it looks with the rose gold i'm kind of like into rose golds lately so I would love love to use this one. They are really really soft. They're just, just super silky smooth. Anyway. Alright, so I have everything. Um, it's a little intense because I'm not very much familiar of the whole set, but I kind of know um, every bits and pieces of them. Um, it looks like this one I'm gonna have so much fun. I love um, shadow blushes that are like really big and really good for blending I just love it just makes the windshield wiper thing makes it easier like whatever so yeah that oh shoot so yeah I got this one and I'm loving this so much and um and I love the package like the whole set including the um including the what do you call this the uh, case the makeup brush case is just so sleek and so nice and you know very fancy so i really loved it um so far my number one um love is the sigma e35 and e40 but that the one that i saw in here in this whole set they might be a competition so my next one i opened it already and i do not know how there's some like pieces of hair coming out from it. I don't know why though. Is it gonna be doing that the whole time? I hope not. And uh, it, it comes with like a container like this, but it's a little too fluffy. It's kind of hard to like push it in there. So I kind of did not close it. I opened it and I couldn't close it anymore. So yeah, I have this one and it comes with so many different kinds of brushes in there which is really so cute i just fell in love with the whole um prints of it and it comes in this set it comes with i think this is 12 or 52 4 6 8 10 11 so it's 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 enough i mean um a lot of this i'll be able to use and a lot my the next thing that I have is the um, Beach Cosmetics Waterproof Lip Liner um, in color petal. I'm kind of like into the lip liner lately, so I'm kind of like trying different brands. Um, my next um, brand that I'm going to try is actually the NARS. I've been hearing a lot of good stuff with NARS and actually I'm going to try the NARS and the MAC. That's my next um, project. So, yeah, this one. It looks really nice. Okay. Okay, my next one is um, a little bit of a drugstore haul with the new products that just came out. Um, I got the Wet n Wild Nail Polish. I got the Wild Shine Clear. This one. I've never tried a Wet n Wild Nail Polish before. So... I'll let you know how it is, you know. And the Wild Shine Nail Color in... What color is this? Putting on Airs? This one? I'm sorry about my nails. It kind of got chipped off. I tried using the, the matte coating. Mm, I'm not really very happy with it. The first time that you put it on, it looks like really beautiful matte. But after a while, it just changes like dirty nail looking thingy so I'm not really very um, excited about that the next thing that I got is also from wet and wild this are the velvet matte lip color and I got different colors I got the timeless chick I'm gonna swatch it 
I really love the packaging though. I love um, lipstick that is like in a crayon form like this. I don't know why. I just find it so convenient. And it's retractable, which is the best part. The retractable. I love retractable stuff. I don't have to sharpen it. Here's the color. It's beautiful. It's very kind of like nude um, brown. Um, I remember when I was in college, I have like a lipstick that is something color like this. But I used to, from the Philippines, um, I used to order a lot of like Avon products. And I used to use that. And I can still remember the name of the color. It's the Cafe Olay from Avon. That's been like my lipstick for like years but i love this one that's why i kind of i get caught i my uh, my attention gets caught up with those kinds of colors the next one is pinky candy pinky candy it's really nice i don't i haven't tried it on my on my lips so but it feels like it looks like it's very matte matte to the highest level and the next one is a little orangey DJ doll let's watch it it's not so bad it's not home um, it's a little orange at first but it kind of probably like um really is nice but you know I kind of don't like the feeling of like it's a little orange I don't know if I'm gonna pull that up but I can probably like put a, another layer of some kind of like a, a lip gloss on top of it. But it's nice. I kind of like it. A little bit. Probably like 100%. Probably like I like it 50%. Now, if I try it on and I really love it on my makeup look, well, I might love it 100%. But we'll see. Okay, this one is in color Plum Plum Gen Plum Genu. Plum Genou. Okay, I think it's Plum Genou. Okay, this is a nice color too. I like it a lot. So I think I got like, a, I really got a good choice when I picked out. I'm not very fond of picking out all colors to swatch it and show to you guys. I'm more comfortable, of, you know, when I purchase something, I want to make sure that I'll be able to use it. Okay, the next one is, I just had to grab this because I got my um, foundation. I got the, I got the Natural Beige 105 for my, um... For my L'Oreal and um, when I got it from um, from Walgreens they didn't have this once but I think I got, I'm not exactly sure if I got the right color but um, this is the 300 nude beige but I'll see how it goes like I'm gonna try to put it on um, on my next video and try this on but they said uh, it's really a great combination, so I will definitely try that and I'll let you know guys how it is. You know, I've been hearing a lot of good stuff, so I'm kind of like, depending on that. Um, a lot of YouTubers already had done um, a review about it, so I'm not exactly sure if I should. But let me know in the comments down below if you're interested to hear about it. You know, like if you've been like um, contemplating of buying that foundation, just let me know because I already have it and you know, we'll see. So far, the foundation uh, worked really well for me. Um, I'm just not exactly sure for the powder. I just wish that, you know, I don't crease on that. So we'll see. And I got that powder, uh, pressed powder, because um, Walgreens are, is having like a, a good deal right now with a buy one, get one half off. So I got this one. This is probably like in a little pricey side. It was $16.99. And then um, they were able to give me a $2 off from it just because it was on a there was like this thing on um, Walgreens that they give away two dollars off for this one so I got this for $14 and then I got the powder in half of the price like about six dollars something because it was like $13 if I if I remember so um, I took advantage of this one because I've been hearing a lot of good stuff about it I'm actually gonna and it smells really good. It smells really good. 
compared with the Mac because I I'm using you know uh, it just depends I just change everything that I use it's either I use my Rimmel mat um what do you call this Rimmel stay mat I use this one sometimes I use my um just depends on the occasion and I feel like you know how long I'll be wearing that I want to wear my makeup so it depends on you know you know what I mean so I just have different choices just so I know which is the best one to use when I'm doing my freelancing you know I bring my um my mac and my stay mat most of the time now I'm gonna add this in my collection on my to bring and probably sooner or later I'm gonna make a video of what's in my train case so I think everything got covered and I think everything that I needed to show you guys I have I've already showed you I was able to give you ideas of you know what's a good buy right now um nothing much but um thank you guys for watching and if you have any questions please feel free to comment down below and I'll talk to you guys next time and please don't forget to subscribe in my channel if you haven't and if you have thank you very much for watching and I love you guys so much and I'm really really happy of being here and you know showing all this for you guys so I'll talk to you guys next time I say guys so much right but anyway I'll talk to you guys next time okay. again bye